Hi, it's Bridget with the Mini Art Show, and I'm here with Laura Inglesby, and she's here to talk about her work. All right, hi. Can you uh, hi. tell me who you are and what you do? I am Laura Inglesby. I am a painter and co-owner of Formed an Artist Collective and Forming Art Studios. Ah, oh, fantastic. And uh, what inspires your work? Because I know you're an artist. Yes. And uh, if you want to point out some pieces, that would be fantastic. Sure. Uh, most of my inspiration, I think, comes from water. Uh, I tend to paint a lot of water and a lot of... Uh, just simple, natural things. Those are my, my big go-tos. Okay, are you a Pisces? Ever? No. Okay, that's Scorpio. what everybody that's what everybody asks. Scorpio is actually a water baby. Oh, so, okay, yeah, yeah. yeah. But, um, so, like, here, I do a lot of waves. Really simple, minimalistic. Oh, um, here's another one up here. Uh, and then for nature, I mean, I've just got a simple little mushroom mm -hmm. collection right there. I, yeah, I'm working on my minimalism of some stuff right now so yeah fantastic yeah. yeah um okay so what was your biggest win in your art career and how did you achieve it uh I would say that it would probably be opening the gallery um yeah it's huge you know, right yeah, it's it a lot to do it's and logistically big, crazy right? oh 100 percent. also taking the leap from like leaving like the nine to five corporate sure job yeah and doing this full time yeah so something you're passionate about absolutely what do you love most about uh, running a gallery uh, just the different kinds of people that we get to meet, the different artists. I mean, we've got over 40 artists in here. It's uh -huh. wonderful, you know, and just like every time you get to see somebody who's just like, whoa. Yeah. I really like that. Yeah, like, inspired, right? Oh, yeah. Yeah. 100%. Mm -hmm. Like if, I mean, we just had somebody come in who was like, man, that just caught me. And they bought the piece, you know, mm -hmm. so it's. It's really yeah. cool to just mm -hmm. see that happen in people. Yeah, so. yeah. And as a good reminder that if you find art that you love, to get it. To buy it. Yeah. 100%. <laughs> don't wait. Don't think yeah. about it. Like, mm -hmm. uh, there, I have so much art regret. Uh -huh. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. If you if you have it, you can always switch it out with something else. Absolutely. And, yeah, uh -huh. You could send it on to someone else. You can, you know, just put it in a different room. Yeah. Change it around, uh -huh. you know. But I don't ever that. deny yourself. Yeah. Good art. When you yeah. Find it. Uh huh. It makes your home, your house a home, right? Yeah. One hundred percent. Okay. And um, where can people find more about your stuff or or Ford? My stuff. So you can go to um, formgallery.com. dot com. Mm -hmm. uh, you can find uh, information about all of, a lot of our artists, um, what we have going on here, some stuff about our art studios, uh, and then you can find me at at waxingmooncollective dot com. Um, okay. All one word. Yeah, waxingmooncollective.com okay. dot com or at waxingmoon collective for my social media handles. So. Oh, Facebook, Instagram. Yep. Yeah. Exactly. Are you a TikTok? I am. Okay. Yeah. There we go. <laughs> yep. All right. Thank you for your time. Thank you.